recently picked up a pair of Boston Birkenstock clogs for fall. Today I'm going to be showing you how I plan to style them. <laughs> that is a little different from the style that you've probably been seeing a lot on TikTok and that is because the buckle is bigger and it is a matte gold. These are the Boston Big Buckle Clogs. I'm pretty sure that they're sold out everywhere. I managed to snag them off of Goop. And I will link any Boston Birkenstocks that I can find in stock in the description below along with similar outfits to the outfits that I'll be styling. A lot of these things can be styled with each other which I think is great. going to be pieces that you have in your wardrobe. So let's get started. So this outfit is super easy. I actually wore it yesterday just to run some errands. These jeans I thrifted, they are Calvin Klein and I got them two sizes too big so that they would have more of a baggy fit. I also just rolled them in the back but I also like them unrolled for more of a slouchy like low rise look. This top is from Target, I will link it down below. I love the high neck and the sleeve length. And then this bag is a Balenciaga Classic City bag. I got it for my birthday, it's from spring summer 2011 in the color praline. So this is a really good fall trend transition outfit. It's way too cold today to wear this. Let me show you what I would throw on if I was going to go out. Okay, so this trench I thrifted. You can find the best coats at the thrift store, I swear, but I will link similar items down below, but I just love the look of like the buckle detailing with the buttons and the long length of the coat. This is exactly what I would throw on if I was going to run out in this outfit today since it's so cold. So I haven't changed much about this look. I've just thrown on this off the shoulder sweater from H&M. I almost wish I got it a little more oversized so that it was more slouchy, but it's one of my favorites. You could also swap this look out for pretty much any sweater. I think sweaters and jeans with your Birkenstocks is a pretty safe go-to that you can always rely on. This is a good work from home look though. I really love this top. It's from Vestique. I'll try to link something similar, but I just throw this on whenever I have like a Zoom call. But I would also, I mean, I would go out in this. I think that this is cute and I like the like ruffle detail kind of contrasting with the casual of the outfit. From sort of dressy to really, really casual, this sweat set is from Target. And I think this is a great look you're around the house or like you're going over to a friend's house for a movie night. You know, I really, think of Birkenstocks in the same way that I think of Uggs as like just the throw on and go type shoe like anything that you would wear your Uggs with you could probably wear your Birkenstocks with which I think is like a really easy hack for your mind yeah so this set is one of my favorites my boyfriend's friends tell me that I look like a potato sack in it but they just they don't get it okay so I have to admit that I stole this look off of Pinterest it didn't immediately come to my mind but I would definitely wear it and I have all the pieces for it this puffer you guys have probably seen several iterations of this one is from the lucky brand and I got it at TJ Maxx last year but I will link similar ones below I just have a white crop tee from Target underneath as a layering piece I love these tees I have like three or four of them and I wear them all the time and they're only like five dollars so I will link those below and then these like cream pants are from Target from last year as well same look just a little bit different because I'm sure that many of you have jackets in your closet from last fall or the season before that one. This one is from Zara. I got it two years ago, but I will link something similar down below. But again, just an easy jacket to throw on. I know that it can feel like jackets take away or cover up your outfits in the fall and winter, but it really makes getting dressed so much easier because you just wear something basic on the bottom. And then whenever you add your jacket, it adds something extra to your look and really completes the outfit. So this look is another great one for early fall. I've just paired this button down chunky knit cardigan that I found in store at H&M with a pair of leather shorts, Birkenstocks of course. And then this bag I recently thrifted. It is a Marc Jacobs hobo bag. I feel like this look you can very easily recreate. This has been my go-to recently because I'm so ready for fall. So something similar but different because I thought that you might also have a piece like this in your wardrobe. This quarter zip sweater is from last year from Kohl's but I'm pretty sure that they still have it. I wouldn't normally shop at Kohl's but I really wanted one of these for a camping trip I was going on. And I love whenever websites allow you to look at something online and see if it's available for pickup in the store. That was how I was convinced to pick this up. I've just styled it with the leather shorts and the same white tee. This bag is old from Topshop. I do a lot of working from home, a lot of working from coffee shops, so just a casual look. Swapped the black leather shorts out for cream leather shorts. I've also worn this outfit with jeans literally this weekend. So like I said, a lot of the outfits can be styled with different pieces to make it more wearable for you, just depending 
depending on what you're looking for. This sweater I thrifted. I love this big like seam on the front of the little sweatshirt detail and I just think that the cuffs are fun. I don't know. It's just it's just fun. Brought out the leather pants for this look. I've also worn this exact outfit, but with yoga pants and studs, you could definitely do that. Just a solid black underlayer and then this ribbed long cardigan. This is from H&M from last year, but I will link something similar. This tube top is just from American Eagle and my leather trousers are old from H&M as well. And then like I said, I've just worn it with some black flare yoga pants as well and it was super casual and easy. This one's one of my favorites. So this look features my favorite pair of linen pants. These are from Guest Jeans and I thrifted them and I love them. They're so easy to throw on. They're so comfortable. This sweater is from Billabong and I got it at Vita Boutique in Raleigh and then we've already talked about this bag but this is definitely one of my go-to outfits whenever I don't know what to wear and I just want to throw something on. So I haven't actually worn this look yet but I put it together this morning and now I am very excited to wear it. These cargo pants are honestly not my favorite. I thrifted them. They're just a little too small and a little too low rise but you get the point. This oversized turtleneck is old from Zara. The point is cargo pants, oversized sweaters, you can really do a lot with the Birkenstock. The more I saw these cargo pants, the more I actually like them. This little sweater is very similar to those that are trending on TikTok. You know, the striped ones because of the collar that's on it. It's just a little big for me, so I have it pulled back. But this one I thrifted, and it's technically from Banana Republic, but I don't know if they still have it because I thrifted it. But you get the point. Like, those v-neck sweaters that are very on trend could go so well with the Birkenstocks, even if you got the more nautical one. That completes this video. Check the description for links to these items or similar items. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!